Hi, this is Nicholas again. Uh, welcome back to the shop. This is probably my most, uh, my most useful tool in the shop. I love my Chinese power hammer. It's pneumatic. It creates its own air. It works fantastic. So this is a Russian farmer's anvil that a friend gave me uh, a few years ago. This is where most of my knives get all their finishing work done. This is my current armoring project. It's a reproduction of a uh, 16th century pikeman's armor. Uh, I have a long way to go. There's lots of spikes. Love making helmets. This is a 16th century <sighs> dusty Italian version A, what they called the heroic age. So this is owed to the labors of Hercules. From the 16th century, we can go all the way back to Roman. This is my Roman cavalry helmet. It's a little dusty too. This is all done in a skill called chasing and repose, which means from the front and from the back. Um, it's basically drawing in steel. So it's a lot of fun. It's one of the things I really enjoy. I'm back in sunny Southern California in Simi Valley at my home forge. And uh, this is where the magic happens. Most of this is armor shop, but I have all the tools for making blades and weapons. Yeah, when I make a knife, I use maybe two or three hammers, not very many. When I make armor, I can use 30 or 40 different hammers and many different shapes for stakes. Uh, all of my armor work is done hot using a rosebud torch. These are my two most prized possessions, and they don't really have any real value, but both of these were used in making the Statue of Liberty, and that holds a, a pretty special part um, for me being American. I have a background in medieval martial arts. Armored combat, it's my favorite thing in the world to do. I'm Nicholas. I'm Dave. And we're gonna hit each other in the head with sticks. For fun. <laughs> and we do tournaments and melees, from one-on-one -on -one to a thousand guys on each side. It's fun, you get to hit your friends as hard as you can and then go have a beer with them after. All right. That's all you get. I'm tired. <laughs>